First, lay out your clip or clips and put a background on the bottom layer, then go to the color page. Now, click these keyframes so that it auto keyframes every movement you do with the pen tool. Click the masking tab and select the pen tool, since that's the one we're using today. Once selected, zoom into your clip and click to set where you want to start rotoscoping. If you click and hold, you can bend the lines you make. Now, just carefully cut out your character or object. Take your time when doing this so it can come out as good as it can get. You can zoom out to have a look. Now with the red playhead on the bottom right, move right 3 to 4 frames with the arrow keys. After you do that, fix all the points you made and line them back up to your character or object. Since you auto keyframed, if you move the playhead in between the keyframes you made, you can see all the points move with your character or object. Now repeat all the way to the end of the clip. If your clip slows down in the middle, you can gap out the keyframe by more frames like 5 to 6 or even 8 in some cases. You can move back and forth to check how it looks. Once you're done all the way through, drag your playhead left and right to see how it looks. Finally, right-click in the node area to add an alpha output and connect your clip to it. And you're done! Go to the edit page and look at how it came out.